Hey everybody, welcome back to the brand new video. Today we have $500 worth of boom boxes to open up. We've got the Elite Boom Box here, which is about 260 bucks. The Platinum Baseball Box, about 140, and the Mid End, 90 bucks. We'll get things started with the Mid End, and thank you very much for joining us. It is a very busy day around here. I am likely going to have at least two videos for you, maybe more. Tops uh, has sent me something via FedEx. I don't know if it's going to come up today, but we'll see. I ordered like five different products from Tops last week. We'll see if another one comes in. I've got a Bowman Chrome Light new release preview box video for you coming up in just a little bit. And before I get into this first box, we'll start with the mid end. I'd like to remind you we're doing a giveaway, giving away all kinds of stuff. I'm putting a new item in the pot every single day. That's a $500 Mike Top box topper. Today I'm throwing in a Bryce Harper rookie card. And for those folks donating stuff to the Christmas giveaway, if you have a card you'd like to send for me to pass on, you can send it to me right there and I will pass that on. Christmas night is the big giveaway. And all you have to do is be subscribed. I'll be posting a video soon with more information on how to be eligible. So let's go ahead and rip this first box open. It is a $90 box. Very comparable to some other boxes you've seen on the channel, such as the Big Fly box and the Pen box. Those are also $90 boxes. Let's go ahead and check out what we've got in here. So this month, the month of December, we will have a 2021 Finest pack. Pretty nice one right there. A chrome pack. We'll be looking for the J-Rod. Or not the J-Rod. Sorry. The uh, the Goldie and the Judge. We'll be looking for J-Rod in this, though. Bowman Chrome Hobby Pack. We've got a Allen and Gitter Pack. Another Bowman Chrome. That's pretty awesome. Two Bowman Chrome Packs. Tell you what. Those are not inexpensive packs. Bowman Chrome costs almost $300 a box for just 12 packs. We've got a Series 2 pack an archives pack, and a miners pack. I like that pack line up there uh, for just uh, 90 bucks. I think that's um, pretty darn freaking good right there. You can see those hit odds in Bowman Chrome are one in six. And I'm going to be honest with you. I think this might be one of my favorite pack lineups from the at least the mid-end $90 box in some time. I think it's pretty quality. Let's go and start off with the minor league heritage. About a one in nine chance of finding an autograph in here because there's, oh, what is there? 18 packs per box, two autos. We have something upside down. This could be it. It's a Marco Luciano. He's a great prospect, but it's not numbered. And nothing else in there. Next, we'll move ahead to archives and see what we've got in this one. Hope everyone's having a very pleasant Sunday. I'd like to remind you we have an auction tonight. It is a consignment, and I have two big, massive consignments Jason Simon and Matt Seedman. I've chosen Matt Seedman's for tonight. Um, and Jason's will do on Thursday, but both have submitted a bunch of binders filled with stuff. So if you love the binders, we'll have those along with a whole bunch of other items. Nothing in that pack. Let's check out the Series 2 Hobby Pack next. We've got a Lane Thomas leading things off in this one. AJ Pollock. Taylor Trammell hoping for the short print of the J-Rod and didn't get him. We got a Goldie. Hopefully we can find that one in our Chrome Pack. Let's go and try that one right now. Here we go. By the way, I was cleaning up some cards and I did a blaster box video. I did an entire case and I, I picked, I had one spot left over, so I took it for myself. And at the time I didn't know it, but I pulled an Aaron Judge refractor out of my um, blaster box that I did at the end of that blaster box of uh, 2022 Chrome video. And uh, just found that. So I'll have to trade that one in. 40 bucks for that card is the credit they'll give us. Next, we've got Allen and Ginter. I don't think it's a fun one, but this pack, unfortunately, not so fun with nothing going on in there. So the best packs we're saving for last. That's what I usually do in each box. We're going to try the finest pack next. We've got Anthony Rizzo leading things off. There's a Ronald Acuna Jr. legacy card in there as well. And unfortunately, we are striking out, but Bowman Chrome is going to hopefully save the box. we got Anthony Volpe, a very nice prospect at the end here. There's Jose Altuve. Curtis Mead Refractor, Pete Cromstrong, and there's the Volpe. And now we are down to our last pack. Oh, boy. Here we go. Jonathan India, Gavin Sheets rookie card. And unfortunately, that was a big K, big strikeout for the mid-end box of this month. Didn't really get anything. I don't even think we got one numbered card, if I'm not mistaken. The Marco Luciano was, uh, I think, the only parallel. 
but sometimes when you start slow, things will start to heat up. So let's see what we can find in the platinum box next. $140 box. Here we go. I'm really interested to see what's in the Bowman Chrome light boxes. Those went on sale on Fanatic's website. I think it was on like Wednesday this past week. They're $139 plus tax and shipping. So after the tax and shipping, you're looking about $150 a box. About half the price of a hobby box. We'll be ripping those open and see if it's uh, see if it's worth it. We'll be looking for some of the big new rookies in there, like Christian Vaccaro and Yasser Mercedes, in just a little bit. I always love the fact that they give us a one touch. Let's take a look at the pack lineup here. We got Bowman's Best from 2020. We've got a Bowman Hobby Jumbo Pack, a Bowman Chrome Pack right there, Series Two, another Bowman Chrome, and a Allen and Ginter pack as well so this is the 149 dollar box you'll notice there's less packs but the uh the 2022 bowman jumbos are pretty expensive there's the lineup right there you can see the hit odds and also i should note that uh, here's their social media links if you'd like to follow them and they're running a julio ticket promo this month where they're giving away a julio rodriguez autographed mariners jersey and uh, that's a pretty crazy prize right there. Imagine winning that one. We'll get things started with Allen and Ginter first, since it is the lowest of the um, lowest uh, on the totem pole, so to speak, in terms of value. We get Bobby Wade Jr.'s rookie card, which is a nice one. That's the best card so far of this video. And then maybe now we'll start to warm up a little bit. And we have a some sort of fruit right there, so we'll put that one off to the side. So Bobby Witt, best one so far. Let's do our chrome pack and see what we've got in here. Just four cards in these. O'Neill Cruz, nice. So now we're starting to hit some nice base cards. O'Neill Cruz, a lot of people consider that to be the best rookie in that uh, base set. We've got a Bobby Dalbeck, Prism Refractor, and JD Martinez in there as well. We'll do the Bowman's Best Pack next from 2020 and see what we can hit in this one. Oh, there we go. J Rod, Julio Rodriguez, Bowman's Best from 2020. So we are starting to see the tides turn in this boombox video. Got off to a really slow start. Still no hitch yet, but starting to find some nice cards. Tatis, second year card. We've got a Mike Trout franchise favorites and a Pete Alonso refractor, second year card as well. Let's go ahead and try out the Bowman Chrome. Pack next, Raphael Devers starts things off. We've got a Joe Adele. It came to the league, George Valera, and Daniel Cueva is the last one there. Next up, we've got Jonathan India, Gavin Sheets, and Josh Lowe, Jackson Job, and Luis Mesa. So here we go. I think last month we had five autographs from the Elite Boom Box itself. We haven't found a single one yet. This is going to be our best chance of getting on the board for an autograph. It is a 2022 Bowman Jumbo Pack. We've got Shane Boz leading things off. The first half of the pack will be all of your veterans and rookies from 2022. And then we'll get into some Chrome cards in the middle. Jaron Duran. We've got High Five Futures with Jordan Lawler. Look at this! A Wander Franco pink! There we go! Wander Franco Pink number to 299. There's our big hit of this video. I, I don't know exactly what this is worth. I do not have eBay all ready to go and look it up, but I'll tell you what, back a few months ago, back in the spring actually, Wander Franco parallels like this were selling for massive amounts of money. I cannot wait to look this one up, and I will probably have to use the one touch on this one. Luckily, they sent us a free one touch. That's a big hit right there. That is likely going to be the best of the entire video. Khalil Watson first. I would rather have that than, uh, honestly, most autographs that we could pull. I'd rather have that out of 299. That is a pretty nice pull right there. So, despite no autographs in the Platinum $140 box, we did pull some really good stuff out of there. There's four really nice cards headlined by the big Wander Franca. Here's the last one, folks. It's the Elite Boom Box, the $240 Boom Box. It is expensive because the packs are of the highest quality. Let's see what we have in here. And look at this. There is a museum collection pack in there. That is a guaranteed auto or relic. Those boxes are over between three and four hundred dollars a box. Usually, over, definitely over three hundred. Um, let's see what we've got in here. So, 2020 Bowman's Best, a 2017 Bowman's Best going way back. That's pretty cool. 
a 2019 Bowman's Best. We've got the museum collection right there. We've got Allen and Ginter. We've got Bowman Chrome yet again at 2020. Wow, this is a Bowman's Best Bonanza right here. Another Bowman Chrome pack and also a Bowman 2022. All hobby packs with the boom box. I don't believe that they ever send anything that's not hobby. Every now and then they used to put in some opening day packs here and there. But uh, it's all hobby all the time with the boom box. And I really like this lineup here. There's no 2018 Bowman's Best because that is just insanely expensive. But we have a nice run here of four Bowman's Best packs. And 2022 Bowman's Best will likely be out, I think, sometime near the end of December. That's usually when they come out. Look at these hit odds, by the way. One in three. And there's a one and one right there. So we are going to find some hits in this elite boom box for sure. That is a guarantee. Let's go ahead and get started with the Allen and Ginter pack. Again, the low man on the totem pole. But you do have a chance of pulling a relic or auto in here. One in three chance. Uh, check that. That's Bowman's Best. One in what is it? One and eight, I guess. 24 packs in the Allen and Ginter. Nothing in there. So let's do our Bowman hobby pack next from 2022. Saw that Reds logo and was hoping it was going to be Ellie De La Cruz, but it's not. That's okay. Let's see what we've got going on. There's Bobby Witt Jr. And the very nice prospect card right there. Eddie's Leonard and Justice Thompson to finish off that pack let's do let's do the bowman chromes and see if we can finally get a hit here i feel like this will now be six total packs we've opened of bowman chrome haven't had a hit yet uh, jordan walker is a nice one nice green number to 125 so i like that one he's a good prospect eddie's leonard right there and here's our last bowman chrome back we've got curtis mead who's a good prospect and here comes a purple roberto campos it will be numbered to 250 oscar colas is a really nice prospect as well so two color cards but no autographs from the six bowman chrome packs in the boom boxes this month now let's go ahead and try the bowman's best we'll start with 2021 there's five cards per pack and again a one in three chance at an autograph we should hit an auto out of one of these four packs if the odds are going to cooperate with us. A nice Aaron Judge insert in Key Brian Hayes. That's going to be a refractor of his rookie card. Not a bad card right there, but no hit. Let's go to 2020 and see what we can find. In this one, we've got Josh Bell leading things off. Miggy, Nolan Arenado, and we have, there's there it is. There we have our first autograph. It's going to be a Nick Solak numbered auto out of... 150 so a nice one right there we do have our first autograph franchise 2020 nick solak we'll take that one aj puck as well so we're on the board we're going to go back to 2019 right now and try this one out we've got whit merrifield on the back of this pack sixto sanchez a nice atomic corbin carroll not numbered and cody hose is going to be an autograph card so hey, now we're heating up Near the end, go out with a bang here. Cody Hose, nice prospect for the Dodgers. And we have two autographs on the board. Could we make it three right here? The 2017 Bowman Pack coming up. We've got Blake Rutherford, Luke Weaver rookie card. Really hoping this is going to be an Aaron Judge, but I think it might be a pitcher. It is going to be Clark Schmidt. We've got another autograph, Jeter Downs. How about that? Three for three in a row and a Goldie at the end. So three consecutive autograph pulls. It got off to a really slow start there, folks. No autos through the almost the entire video. And then the last three packs had hits. And the final pack is going to hit as well because there will be an autograph or a relic in here with Museum Collection. So thank you very much for watching. I hope you hit that subscribe button. We do these videos every single day. And sometimes, like today, two a day. Actually, if you count the auction, it'll be three. So I hope you can join us for Matt's auction. He always has amazing stuff. Let's go ahead and take a look at what we have in this final pack, Museum Collection. All right, so here we go. We have Tony Gwynn starting things off. We have a Babe Ruth in there. Then there's a Ricky Henderson canvas collection. I'm going to save the hit for last, Albert Pujols. And now let's see what we have. The final hit, it is going to be a quad relic of Wilson Contreras out of 99. That kind of is par for the course with my luck with museum collection. I always tend to find cards like that, but a uh, nice four consecutive hits in a row to end off the video. So there you have it, folks. That's the 2022 December box 
for the boom box. If you'd like to grab one of these for yourself, you can get them at their website. Um, I'll put a link down in the description or you could just go to their website, theoriginalboombox.com and grab one for yourself. So thank you very much for watching. We'll be back in a little bit with Bowman and Chrome light boxes. Really looking forward to seeing what those are all about. Make sure you hit that subscribe button, folks. I hope you guys have a great rest of your Sunday, and I hope to see you in our live stream auction tonight of Matt Seedman's packs. He's the same guy that makes the Magic Matt's mystery packs, which have been amazing. And he's got a whole, he's got an amazing collection, and he's forwarded a bunch on to us to auction off tonight. So I hope to see you tonight. If not, I will see you all later. Good night, everybody.